Hello everybody, <clears throat> sorry I'm under the weather. Uh, my name is Vitaly with uh, Vacation Travel Accommodations. Um, and today we're gonna be talking about the lovely island of Aruba. So um, if you are interested in exploring the island, uh, I'm hoping that it, the information that I provide to you today is gonna be helpful. Um, within Aruba, um, there are two uh, popular beaches. Um, if you're looking for something that's um, more, uh, I guess, uh, has more of a party vibe, you're probably going to be uh, looking at uh, Palm Beach, and uh, that's which is on the west west coast side of Aruba, and uh, the other beach that's uh, a lot quieter, um, more so for relaxation, um, that's going to be Eagle Beach. It's also on the west side of Aruba, um, just a little bit further south of um, Palm Beach. Um, if you're looking for um, luxury resorts within Aruba, um, I do have a list of resorts that I, I would recommend. Um, within Palm Beach, um, you're looking at um, Ocean Z Boutique Hotel, um, uh, the Ritz Carlton, uh, Aruba Marriott Resort and Stellaris Casino. Uh, there's the Hyatt Regency Aruba Resort and Casino. There's also the Hilton Aruba Caribbean Resort and Casino. Now, moving down south to Eagle Beach, uh, you have options of uh, Amsterdam Manor Beach Resort. Uh, also, the DV Aruba Phoenix Beach Resort. And heading further south, also, also this is all on, on the western side of Aruba. Um, Manch this is in uh, Manchibo Beach. Uh, man there's the Manchibo Beach Resort and Spa, Sp Spa, sorry. And there's the Bakuti and Terra Boutique Beach Resort, uh, which is all for adult only. Sorry if I uh, mispronounced that. Um, and then there's also a luxury resort uh, within um, the city of Orangestad. Um, it's on the water. It's the Renaissance Wind Creek Aruba Resort. So those are some of the luxury resorts. There are a lot of um, other resorts that are a lot more affordable. Um, if you're looking for them, for, for something a little cheaper, please let me know. We can uh, definitely find that for you as well. Um, some of the things that, um, that you can do on the island of Aruba, um, you can uh, go sailing, uh, scuba diving, snorkeling, uh, deep sea fishing, surfing, kite surfing, paddle boarding, uh, parasailing. Uh, you could also take um, Jeep trips through the island. Uh, you can go horseback riding, uh, mountain biking. There's casinos and nightlife. And of course, there's also shopping districts. Um, a lot of these we can uh, book you through a tour. Um, there's a lot of different tours in Aruba. And um, if you fly out there and stay in one of these resorts, we would be happy to add a, um, a, a, a one day tour, um, which would probably make your experience that much better. Um, if you are going to Aruba for um, romance, we have there, they have a lot of uh, destination, uh, destination weddings. So if you're looking to get married on the island of Aruba, um, it's uh, very, very well known for that. Um, if you're taking honeymoons, um, or honeymoon. Uh, there's a lot of perks available at a lot of the resorts for honeymoons. A lot of these perks are within like a 90 day time frame of you getting married. So if you're looking for a honeymoon within Aruba, let me know. They do vow renewals, propo proposals. So for you guys looking to propose, Aruba is a wonderful, uh, wonderful island to do that. And of course, the well-known bachelor and bachelorette parties. Um, now, for families, uh, the Day Palm Island, on a day trip to Day Palm Island, um, an all-inclusive private island, visitor, visitors can enjoy a lunch buffet, uh, open bar, snack, corner, snorkel equipment, banana boat rides, water, par water park, beach volleyball, beach lounge chairs, uh, salsa lesson, table tennis, and basketball. For an additional charge, they can opt to uh, participate in um, 
Sea Trek, Underwater, Helmet, Walk, or Snooba. Um, there's also um, one happy family program on this on the island. Um, this program is aimed at families who stay at participating hotel or resorts. Uh, when sharing the same room with one or two paying adults, children 12 and under stay free and enjoy free daily breakfast at the designated hotel restaurant. Um, upon check-in, children receive a free gift. They also receive a very important kid passport, uh, a fun booklet filled with quizzes, puzzles, and questions that can be answered when visiting seven featured signature locations on the island. When a minimum of four locations have been visited and those portions of the passport completed, the re registration page in the booklet can be returned to the front desk to enter a raffle for a one week return vacation to Aruba, including four airline tickets. The selection is done at a random at the end of the summer and during the month of December. Um, there is a, on the island, you'll also find adventure by land and sea. You're, uh, you can indulge uh, in wild side by windsurfing, kite surfing, or cruising on a catamar catamaran through the clear, gentle turquoise waves, or scuba dive and snorkel along the reefs and shipwrecks below. The warm Southern Caribbean has graced Aruba with the world-class water sports. So, uh, uh, Venture Island, and they'll find more, even more to experience. Um, explore the caves and ancient boulders of Aricoque by foot, horseback, or four-wheel drive vehicles. Uh, dive headfirst into the tranquil depths of Kanchi, a hidden natural pool. Uh, it's easy to wander our whole island in search of happy adventures. Uh, water adventures include visitors can board a catamaran for scenic stops along the coast, opt for snorkeling and diving adventures, or simply relax with a cocktail on a sunset cruise. Those craving more of an adrenaline rush can try Jet Love. Participants don a water-propelled jetpack hover just above the water or fly up to 30 feet high, Ex um, exclusive at Red Sail Sports. Uh, so if you are looking for some high adrenaline activities, that's one you would probably want to look into. Um, you could also propel, propel themselves with an underwater scooter. <coughs> uh, on the nature and wildlife side of uh, Aruba, um, the Aricoque National Park. Um, you can view dramatic landscapes and uh, visitor centers exhibit of Aruba, Aruba's endemic animals such as the Ur Uruba, Aruban burrowing owl or the local birds of prey Wara Wara and kin kin Kini Kini, whiptail lizard, Aruban cat eye snake, and endangered rattlesnake. Um, hiking tours showcase fascinating flora and fauna and interesting historical sites. Uh, Babali, Bubali Bird Sanctuary. This is a uh, resting and breeding area for more than 809 species of migratory birds located within the walking distance of Palm Beach Resort. The observation tower allows bird watchers to get a true bird's eye view. Um, there's also a butterfly farm. Here visitors can step into a tropical garden teeming with butterflies from around the globe. Donkey, um, there's also a donkey sanctuary. Uh, here the herd of donkeys in their patchwork of uh, coats from gray to deep chocolate brown floppy ears and inquisitive personalities enchant visitors. Um, there's the ostrich adventures, a flock of approximately 80 of the largest living species in the world and their flightless Australian relatives are waiting to greet or to meet guests at the Aruba ostrich farm. Um, there's the Phillips Animal Garden. Phillips Animal Garden offers 
interactive and educational tours uh, where visitors can enjoy an up close and personal experience with over 50 species of exotic animals from around the world. There's also the sand dunes. Um, I guess the best sand dunes I've ever seen was in Death Valley, but I guess they have, uh, based on the pictures, it looks like the ones in Aruba are really cool because they're right by the water. Um, the, unex the unexpected sight of massive sand dunes often intrigues visitors touring the Northeast Coast. Um, California dunes at the Hadeshibana on the isolated northwestern tip of the island feature some of the most spectacular scenery with expansive sand dunes sitting in the view of the old stone lighthouse and spectacular rock hewn coastline. Um, they have uh, cave explorations. Um, you can <coughs> again sorry for uh, my cough I'm a little bit under the weather so the cave explorations uh, you can enjoy mysterious views of the rock drawings and nature's artwork of stalagmites and stalactites um, there's a, a natural there's also natural bridges uh, and rock formations for thousands of years, pounding waves and strong winds have slowly chiseled away at the limestone cliffs along Aruba's north coast to create several natural bridges. For such a relative flat, <clears throat> sandy uh, island, the presence of the unusual hills and huge monolithic boulders that dot the countryside are truly an enigma. These remarkable geological formations add aesthetic to the landscape and provide excellent vantage points from which two better views uh, view or two better view the island. They also have natural pool on the deserted stretch of coastline. Dramatic shows of water spraying over the rock occur on a regular basis as the tide rushes to shore in a unique formation of rock. Volcanic stone circles a small depression creating tranquil pool known as Conchi Cura de Tortuga, or the natural pool. So as you can see, um, Aruba has a lot to offer. Um, if you're into adventurous activities, if you are into wildlife, if you are into partying, or if you want to just relax at the beach or at the resort, um, Aruba has all of that. Uh, so if again, if you're interested to uh, book your vacation to Aruba, please let us know. You can uh, reach me at 443-508-8805. Um, you could also um, email me at vitaly at vacaytravelay.com. Um, I'm going to provide all the ways to contact me in the uh, description below. Again, my name is Vitaly with Vacation Travel Accommodations, and it was uh, a pleasure to go over some of the best that Aruba has to offer. Have a nice day. Bye.